You got the touch, you got the power to shape shift here, bring you a Transformers review. This is a Transformers Prime Robots in Disguise Wheeljack. Yeah, let me just go into the back. Here's his bio. As a former member of the Wrecker, Wheeljack is more than capable of taking care of himself. But he's glad to know that at least one of his old friends, Bulkhead, is still around bringing the pain to the Decepticons. Yeah, pretty, pretty cool file. And he's a uh, Series 1003. And there's his car mode. I kind of have a window open, that's why you're seeing the glare. Yeah, so... Plus, if you want to know, the date is February 18th. Uh, yeah, so I'm celebrating this, which is the Season 2 of Transformers Prime, which I'm celebrating by reviewing Transformers Prime Robots in Disguise. So, yep, enough with the packaging. And into a figure. Yeah, so... he Now, accessories, he comes with two swords, which can store under here, but I like to keep it on off because it kind of lifts up one of his wheels, and I'm kind of more like where all the wheels touch the ground. Yeah, so... <coughs> <coughs> Sorry there. But yet... Yet, uh, yet, it's more of like a... Where do you like his vehicle mode? Well, uh, size comparison with an uh, ordinary deluxe class. Here, size comparison with, uh, Bumblebee. Is, uh... He just, as you can see, he's quite short. Yeah, so. And for, uh, Dark of the Moon, here's Bumblebee. Quite, quite the same size, only off by an inch. Yeah. And I do have a generation. Wheeljack, but I was, but his arm was loose. I tried fixing it with some super glue, and it kind of, it's kind of a little bit bothering me. So I keep him in place. So, yeah. So now I'll transform this guy. Just separate this right here. Pull it out. Second first, same as first. Like so. Now you just lift this up. See this tabs into here, so I lift it up till this till this tab tabs into here. Yeah, so okay now let's separate the legs. Rotate them around till the tabs into place. Slide this up and rotate that around and flip up his foot. Rotate that around and flip out this spike. And second verse, same as first. And there, you have his feet. And you just, then you just angle these up. Rotate that around. Same on the other side. Yeah, so fold this down. Oh, yeah. And you just, just lift this up to reveal his head. And fold this down to see the. There's a tab right here. And the slot right here. And you just. And also, uh, same as on here. Right there, and you just slide them on in there. Up, oh. like so. Now you just pull out this arm, pull pull this out, rotate that around, and then you just. Push that in, like so, 
Second verse, same as first. Out. And there you go. And right here, you just want to separate these. Give them the final wheeljack look. And there you have Transformers Prime Robots in Disguise Wheeljack. Yeah, so it's really, really neat. Uh, head is on a ball joint. You can look around. Well, let's not get into artic articulation yet. It's just here's his weapon. Now storage. You can. There's a plug right here, tab right here, and a hole right here. You can store these on here, but, but if you've seen Payoff's re video review of this, you can fly this in here, which is what I usually do, like so. And, yeah, I like displaying him and with his swords, him holding the swords. Yes. Light it. There we go. This uh, okay. There we go. And there he has a sword. And just and there you have it. Have him like that. Yeah, pretty neat. And you can also even plug them in like like this. Yeah, pretty neat. Yeah. Yeah. So articulation. His arms are on a ball joint, and uh, whatever this scene is, can rotate all around, rotate 360 degrees. And bends at the elbow, and, it can, and do the transformation, you can also bend right here. And he also has a swivel and ball joint in his hand. Fed is also on ball joint, as I also mentioned. He can also bend right here. Yeah, same on the other side. And his legs are on a ball joint. And knees can also bend. And feet are on a ball ball joint. Yeah, so that's yeah, that's pretty much it. Yeah, well, I was lucky enough to find this at Toys R Us on Saturday, last Saturday, and and uh, he was. I only saw one of this guy, and they all have a uh, Cliff Jumper and Bumblebee, which I'm definitely not gonna get them because I rather like the first edition Cliff Jumper, but yet they they're not gonna sell them here in America. Yep. And and I really do dislike the Bumblebee. Yep, I'm but yet I'm hearing very good reviews on him, but but so uh, I might pick him up. So yeah, so if you are able to see this guy, pick him up cuz he's a great buy. A really great buy. Yeah, so Next week, I'll be reviewing another Transformers Prime figure. Might review uh, either Starscream, RC, or Bumblebee. So, this has been a Shapeshifter review. And this this one-on-one Shapeshifter saying, Till all are one.